Hey guys, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. We are going to see if there's any messages for Libra today. Messages for Libra. Okay, so you might want to cover up the errors. You might feel that you made a mistake and you want to cover it up. Um, you're trying to have a plan to go in the right direction here. Something has changed overnight. That could be why you want to cover up any errors. We have the lead the way card. Be a leader. So you want to show how it's done. You can help others. You're going to discover something weird. Wondering what's going to happen next. You're ready to adventure. But pause before action. You can't really have discovery. It's weird. You might be curious. Strike your curiosity. If I was just thinking about that one too. Believe strange encounters. So there's something strange going on. Might even flare up a temper. So lately there might be somebody that suddenly is like, they're telling you one thing, but doing the opposite. Actions show more than words. Learning to create what you desire. There can be messages involved, a letter, a call, for some of you. But again, like, it, well, it could be like don't, confirming that it has anything to do with words, but let's see here. It looks like you might be shedding skin and leveling up to another maturity level. Um, because it says rejection of perpetual youth. Usually, when that card comes out, it's like you're, you're a snake that's shedding your skin and you're growing because of this. Really, Ruth, please? Ugh, sorry. <laughs> I can talk. Libra, please. Messages for Libra. Might have something to do with your happy home, but you have double fours. So, this might be a healing process. You might be seeing a lot of green, or green might be sticking out to you. Four represents the color green. Four also represents, like I said, healing. Messages for Libra, please. So, you're manifesting a big gain. Um, you have every ingredient so far. Okay, it's going to bring a fresher perspective from the past. Peter Cups or Messenger. 
our new creation. And it's going to be a project. So it's going to be something you're going to be working on for a while. It's not going to be done overnight. It's going to be a work in progress. It might have something to do with a union. Working with somebody else. Could be with a partner with this happy home. And you might be manifesting what you want to manifest. For some of you, you might be bound to a call. You might also be afraid that you might make some kind of bad judgment. Okay. So you're nurturing because we have the Empress behind the judgment call. You're nurturing what has been self-sabotaged. Like, whatever wrong goes with this project, you'll be able to nurture it and fix it. For Libra, please. Messages. Libra, thank you. You're worried about maybe for some of you a gift, um, some type of uh, handout that you can gain from. There's heartache. Whoa, wow, okay. So we have the Ace of Cups and then we have the Three of Swords. And behind the Three of Swords, we have gain. You might gain some heartache. For some of you, it might have to do with a spouse, um, somebody that's living in your house that's a water sign, or somebody that's near your house that's a water sign, somebody that you might be uh, working with, but um, there's a message coming your way about a project that's, that you're working with, with this person, this <clears throat> water sign, and either boundless or self-sabotage, but you have worried insomnia, you're up all night, it's, there's like a new love, but yet a heartache too. So, it looks like things might not be going right, or good, going well, and you might feel like this is just what the rest of your life is going to be like. I'll pull out my double deck then and get a little deeper here. Let's see if we get anything else, okay. The moon, and these are pentacles. So it's an unknown path that you are taking. Reliever, please.
So, we have a three of cups upright. I read the, the, my double deck upright in reverse. We have a three of cups here in upright position. This a celebration, a communion. Um, there's more than two people at this this position. Then we have the devil, the knight of wands, and the hermit, all three upright. It's like there's tempting adventure to seek knowledge. Or seek yourself, like, go hide out somewhere. Like, being by yourself. And then we have the Hierophant upright. Now, the devil does represent Capricorn. The Hierophant does represent Taurus. The Hierophant has do with like a marriage some type of commitment and then at the bottom of the deck we have our nine of wands which is your block is being removed the gates are moving and we have a contract nine of wands in reverse again It could be an ugly new start for you. Feeling like you're stuck in a rut. Releasing chaos with lovers. Now, lover doesn't always have to be this, a spouse, but we have a higher font, so it could be somebody that you see yourself. Either you are married to, or you, you would... Envision yourself marrying this person. Um, or it could just be a Taurus. But we also have the Empress, which also represents the Taurus as well. It almost feels like you might feel like you, you've lost yourself and it's just with this person you're constantly trying to rebuild, uh, repair what's, whatever you guys are, it's like constantly arguing and repairing it. It's just a continuous cycle. Trap, trap like a rat. So I just... But it's like talking about it though flares flares up some controlling traits. It's being nasty messages. So, now there's one of communication about how this is a cloud of action, or creation. It's not what, what was desired, not what was wanted. There's no balancing out. We can't fix this. It's chaotic. And there's no communication. Stalemate. It's just this. After this message, this communication, beginning, <clears throat> um, let's see, you have a water sign, again, in reverse, so somebody's not going to be honest, or you're dealing with a water sign, um, and they're out of balance, 
could also be a fire sign that's not being honest or your intuition your intuition could be kicking in and realize or know that this person isn't being honest with you karma's going to change And you're going to take this as a lesson. And however this conversation goes. You're going to learn some knowledge. It, it, you're learning a lesson out of this. And in the future, you're, you're going to need this knowledge. It's going to help you continue on in life but after this conversation it's going to stick with you in your mind manifesting you might sit and figure out what it is that you want if you don't know already what you want these things are out of balance Too many secrets. Could have some financial issues with it. Or somebody could have a child that's an earth sign and it's, it's messing with them. It's gonna have to you're gonna have to figure out okay, whatever the bad judgment is here, it has to be gone. We have justice next to the eight of swords, and they're both upright, so there's bound to be justice. But you need to see you need to sorry, not see. You need to eliminate something, sacrifice something, or in order to gain happiness. Or this, the other side of the fence here. Because right now, we have a judgment card in reverse, which represents bad judgment. Angel, please. The Nine of Pentacles in reverse. And the Magician in reverse. So it's like a large loss that wasn't wanted. So a part of you might still really love this person. It's somebody in your home. And this has to do with, like, your lifestyle. Can you ones in reverse? It's going to be a broken union that he's sorry. Whoever this fire sign is, whoever beholds the fire sign, is going to be holding on tight to this. Two of cups in reverse, two of cups upright. So you guys might have been on and off. However, whatever had happened, this person might feel truly foolish about the actions and rethinking about what they did wrong to you
You're going to be like gifted after this. Good judgment. Oh, manifesting. Magician is spinning. You're taking control. You're making, you're going to be making better decisions for yourself. You're going to be healing from heartache. Now, a part of you will be up all night or worried about this new path revealed. There might be, for some of you, if there's not an earth sign involved that's out of balance or if you're not grounded, um, it could put a little damper or you could get scared about your finances, but you have everything to manifest from this heartache. It, you're going to see, you're going to realize more of what, it's like more is going to come out about this person after there's a split. If you resonate with this video so far, please hit that like button. Uncertainty, the shades of gray within the fog eventually lift, will eventually lift within time. Time and grace in the dewdrops of life before they disappear with the morning sun. Adventure, live wild and free. Path, wander on the path less traveled. What you find might surprise you. Hope, an idea like a single acorn can start a wondrous forest. So you're unsure, you're unsure about adventuring onto this path. Of if there's, if you depend on this person, you're gonna be okay. There's hope. An idea like a single acorn can start a wondrous forest. So there's there's more for you on the other side of the fence here. I'm going to close it out with a closed card. Closed card for Libra, please. May I have a postcard for Libra? Thank you. Awesome. Dearest you, do you ever wonder whether your ideas and inspiration might be coming through your soul rather than generated from your mind alone? We are here to tell you we are always whispering in your ear about your highest good. We are conduits for spirit, letting you know you are a living channel for this awesome co-creative energy. When you're feeling inspired, it means you heard us. Inspiration means spirit is breathing through you. Inspiration needs your human passion to keep it going so you can make a difference in the world. So keep moving on what, ins keep moving on, yeah, what inspires you. Let yourself be led into new experiences. And know that this is why you are on earth. Your purpose is to discover your spirited nature and to bring forth through your efforts whatever is meant to be. Wondrous miracles have a way of showing up when you let inspiration propel you forward. You are so, so loved. Alrighty, you guys. Um, it looks like things are going to get better after after this conversation after after there's communication properly fulfilled you, there's a way you can get your point across if you're having issues getting your point across 
sit and meditate, think on it, if that is the case. Um, if you feel as though you've resonated with this message, please hit that thumbs up button. If you want to see more in the future, please hit that subscribe button. If you want to dive in a little deeper and you would like a personal reading, please go ahead and check out that description box. I have contact information down there. Otherwise, you guys, please treat others how you want to be treated. Like always, happy to Zane. Bye-bye.